What is up? Uh, uh, uh. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share, all that, the, the bells, whistles, all that crap. And let's get to the video, shall we? Bike related video, tomorrow I will be shooting the actual ride. The weather has gotten in the way and the schedule has gotten in the way of every ride I was supposed to take. But a ride is coming. So, how is this bike related? I'm gonna go ahead and show you what I've done to the bike. I have here my Schwinn headlight, my selfie stick, and a small little octopus tripod and the bag that is holding that is actually a 511 it's like a tactical vest pouch for uh, magazines and if you know what that is you know what it is if you don't know what it is I'm not saying here I got my Delta cell phone holder this is one of the best cell phone holders for a bike I have found and I've looked for months it actually has a lock on the side here where that you can turn it over and it stays locked, but otherwise it just, uh, see if I can do this one-handed. Slides open, snaps shut, and you got a lock here so it won't move. Um, we know that's a water bottle and that's a bag for it. This case here is actually for the camera I'm using. And down here we have two 64-ounce bottles, jugs, cans, whatever you want to call them on the Blackburn racks and those are on the uh, Bikus mounts. I don't, I think that's how you pronounce it, but yeah. So that's all here. And then if you're on my Twitter, you have seen this guy. This I made out of old inner tubes. I actually found a bike for my wife on the side of the road and I had to get new tubes and new tires for it, new grips. So I took the tubes, and instead of throwing them in the trash, I pulled out the old sewing machine and made myself a bag. It's not waterproof, but I don't care if it's waterproof or not, like these two. I'm putting everything in Ziploc bags. Under that, I have mounted up a pump, so it's out of the way, but I have that. If you've been here a minute, you've seen my uh, video where I broke a pedal and had to buy new ones, so those. Uh, this is the Ibera bag, frame bag that I bought for here, but it was too big. So I just put it back here for this trip today to hold my drumsticks because I came up here to jam with a couple guys. But this hard bag. I'm not even going to try to pronounce this. Uh -uh. Waterproof bag on Amazon for like 40 bucks. But in here I have, let me see if I can get this open with one hand. You know, in here I've got my tools. You know, the Crank Brothers. Can't go anywhere without that thing. Um, little rag for now until I order the Ghost brand sweat rag. We've got two tubes here, some deodorant, zip ties, because zip ties and Ziploc bags, wallet, three GoPros down there, extra battery bricks, all the attachments. I mean, no, I don't need this stuff for the three mile ride to my storage unit, but I'm trying to test everything. The two water jugs will be gone before I get home because it's like 96 degrees outside right now. So, you know, I've got extra batteries in here. All that good stuff. It's got what plants crave. It's got electrolytes. So that is all for the bike now. I am going to add some actual side bags here, pin wars, I believe it's pronounced. But yeah, that is the Trek Marlin 5 now. Obviously we know about the new seat that I've replaced it with. But she is coming together. The Marlin is coming together to be able to hit some Long distances. Oh! The tires! The wheels! Some Continental Contact Urbans, e-bike rated, so they're going to last a little longer on this. They're the Safety Pro, so they're reflective. They are reflective. 
And this is the first ride with these wheels or tires, rubber things. Um, and wow, the difference between a knobby mountain bike tire and these road tires on the road is night and day. As of now, there's only a few more little things that I need to do. I do want to get a, um, I can't remember what this is called, but the bag that goes here. And if I have the room, maybe a seat bag. But that's it, because I plan on taking a really, really, really long trip in the spring. So I've got some conditioning to do, but that's the bike right now. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you on the next one.